I think the maintenance of traditional Aboriginal culture is vitally important to current and future generations of Aboriginal people. I think there are still a lot of really important lessons that we can learn from traditional culture, particularly the moral based stories that are so predominant in our dreaming stories, for example. And you know, with the maintenance of culture, a very important element of that is the maintenance of traditional language. Because if we can get Aboriginal kids interested in Aboriginal language, they then become interested in the natural environment without often being aware of it. Because our traditional language is all about describing this natural environment. It also upsets me when I hear some people say that, you know, culture is dead. I think that's a very unfair statement to make and I think that, you know, as a modern Aboriginal people we need to be aware of the need to constantly involve as an Aboriginal culture. Because history tells us very clearly that those cultures that don't embrace newer technologies may then very quickly uh, become extinct. Obviously I think it's becoming more increasingly difficult for our young people to engage in culture, to learn language, to go hunting and to learn how to make a boomerang. Those things are important because obviously some of those very iconic symbols like boomerangs to Aboriginal culture really form the basis of who we are as a people. So I certainly don't think that there are enough opportunities for young people to learn about our culture and I think that responsibility rests with me and people of my generation because I've been lucky in that the older generation have given me a lot of quality time and have taught me a lot of knowledge. So now I have to then pass on um, that responsibility to ensure that culture continues and uh, is maintained. I think that increasingly the school focus on Aboriginal cultural education is a very good thing. In places like Wilcannia and Menindi now, the local Barkindji language is incorporated into the mainstream school curriculum. If we can get young people interested in language, they then might develop an interest in this natural and cultural environment.